What is up guys, my name is JJ Floppers and today guys I'm going to be showing you where you guys can acquire every single plan in Fallout 76. A lot of you guys wondered how I build my bases and where do I have all these cool items from. So today guys I'm going to be showing you what are the best places, best locations where you guys can acquire them yourself and use them in your own builds. Let's get into it. One more thing before we get started and this is to put on the hard bargain pack. This pack allows you to purchase items at very cheap prices. This means that you will not have to spend as many caps when you're buying items and plans from vendors. So this is the must have if you're trying to buy a lot of plans and very useful plans because some plans are really expensive and this pack just makes it very cheap. So I really do recommend you guys put this on. The first vendor we're going to be visiting is the Watoka Shopping Plaza and this is by far my favorite vendor just because of the items he sells and how big his plan inventory is. You can buy plans for building from him, you can buy tables, chairs, you can buy vending machines, he has it all and what I would do if he hasn't got what I want, I would just dashboard or leave the game, find a different lobby, rejoin, go back to him and every time you do that, every time you leave the lobby and join a different one, go to him, he will have different items in inventory, different plans you guys can purchase and this is what I would usually do to find best plans and if I'm looking for something, this is what I would mainly do the second vendor that we're going to be visiting is a harpist fairy and as you guys spawn in just follow the same route i'm taking and you get to him If any of you are trying to find a brick building set, this is probably the best vendor to visit for it because for some odd reason, that is the most common items he sells and out of the 30 times I've visited him, like 27 times he's actually been selling it, which is very odd. And But this is also a really good way to get it. If you are trying to find a brick building set, this is probably the best vendor to visit. And by my far opinion, like I personally go to him sometimes because he sells like very unique items regarding weapons building stuff he does sell like you know very interesting things he often sells tables and things like vending machines this, all the vending machines I've acquired have been from this guy because for some odd reason he sells a lot of them but yeah this is the second vendor guys the third vendor that we're going to be visiting is located at the white spring resort just follow the path I take So this vendor is probably the one of the biggest inventory and the one with the more expensive items just because he sells restored items and most of the items he sells are furniture so he doesn't sell any building materials or building plants all he sells is restored furniture and different type of furniture the best things he sells are the restored items just because you know they're brand new stuff but they're really expensive in his gameplay i'm not using the bargain perk for some reason that's why the things are so expensive but usually these things would cost you about 600 or 500 caps you know depending what level your bargain perkers but this is probably one of my favorite vendors to buy furniture from because he sells the best furniture and the best looking furniture next place you guys can try visiting to find some decent plans like i do this sometimes myself but these are the train stations and some vendors in the train stations do sell some rare and really awesome plans i personally come across them not very often and that's because vendors on the train stations do not really sell that many plans it's just a handful but it's always worth checking because sometimes they're quite cheap as well and the plans they sell are really good and you know if you're trying to find some basic plans i do recommend you guys you know leave the lobby come back like i said previously if you're trying to find any specific plans in any location that's what i would mainly do but the vendors in train stations are worth checking out because they do have some decent plans sometimes the final way you guys can acquire is some plans and this does not involve you have any caps and simply by capturing the workbench this way every time you capture a workbench you receive items reward items and these can include different type of plans and you, every time you capture a workbench you receive a plan different type of plan this is very useful if you try not to spend any caps on this method because you will get, be guaranteed at least one plan every time you capture a workbench and there is no limit for those so you can capture workbenches as many times as you want and this is a really good method regarding like you know if you're trying to find rare plans because sometimes like myself i couldn't find rare plans so what i did is i spent about half an hour just capturing workbenches and i I was so surprised how many plans I received this is really worth doing if you're trying to get some plans because it's cheap it's so simple which I cannot just stress it's so easy to capture workbench especially when people aren't around and there's rarely people trying to you know fight you back when you're capturing workbench that's just super easy plans for you guys right there 
All right, guys, this was me showing you how to acquire plans in this game, the easiest ways, and how to be able to have the best plans in Fallout 76. If you enjoyed this video, please smack the like button because it shows me that you guys enjoy my videos and it motivates me to make more videos on Fallout 76. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe because I do upload a lot of Fallout 76 videos and I'm really into this game. And I forgot to mention at the start of the video, but I am a little bit sick. If you guys can tell by my voice, I do have the flu, unfortunately, which sucks. But yeah, guys, I'm planning to upload a lot of more Fallout 76 videos. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe, like, and peace out.